Hi, hello, what's up, Jelly Cups? My name is Crispy Jelly, and we're playing more Plants vs. Zombies. I have not been able to get around to this for a while. I'm so happy that I am now, because there was a huge setback. So, if you notice, the layout of this is a little different than it was from the first episode. There's achievements, there's the Zombitar, and oops. Um, and that is because... I am now playing uh, it on Steam. Before, I had the really old file from the original PopCap website. I had had it downloaded. I've had that thing for like seven years. That is really old. And unfortunately, it got corrupted because it's old. And so I had to restart. This current adventure is a different adventure than I played last episode. And I got to the same spot. There's no worries. Everything's the same. It's just now on a more stable area. And there's some other things. So first of all, I got some advent, uh, achievements. So I got Spadow, which is just exploding with a uh, potato mine. This one, take out 10 zombies with a cherry bomb. And mustache mode. That one, that one's a special one. So, but as part of this series, one of the things I'm going to try and do is get all achievements... Which, that that might be a little difficult. Um, and B, to kind of get everything in this game. So, yeah. Also, another thing is the Zombitar. That is cool. Because you get to customize your own zombies. Okay, finished. Save. Oh, rats. Cool. Okay, so that's the Zombitar. And if I'm not mistaken, what the Zombitar does sometimes is appears as the final wave zombie. Okay. Anyway, now with that over, let's get into the real game. I haven't played this in a long time. It's been a couple of days. Evening. Uh, I'm not going to speak for him. No, of course not. Yeah. Ooh. No sun falling from the sky. So that takes about half the sun intake. Ah, and these are the puff shrooms we got last episode. Which, if I remember correctly, yeah, the puff shrooms have zero cost. So they don't cost any sun. That's pretty sweet. Uh, there we go. Oh. Oh, yeah. I remember, you can't plant on graves. I, I've forgotten about those. It's been a while. I remember. This game's awesome. Oh, look at the little guys. Oh, it's nice that they're free. Cause we can. I love just being able to fill up the entire board with these little ones. However, they have limited range. I can only shoot like two or something. So. All right. <clears throat> There we go. Now he's just starting to hit him. So all you have to do, really, in this first, uh, level... Because, again, this is like the tutorial... Oh, anyway. This is like the introduction to this particular world. So, again, it's just gonna be almost the exact same as the starting world. See? But things get difficult in World 2. It doesn't get, like, <laughs> immensely difficult. But things can get pretty obscene. I don't... I'm not... I don't remember quite how difficult things so, yeah. Oh, actually. Oh, wait. Okay. I just remembered something. Okay. I gotta type something in. So let me just... Bam! They've got mustaches. Again, there's more. There's more. Watch this. Bam! Look at those rides. Oh, yeah. We've got some sick lawnmowers. And if I remember, hang on. Bam! Now they've got sunnies. Heck yeah. That's all I would ever want. Zombies with sunglasses. And mustaches. And some sick lawnmowers to run them over with. And I'm keeping them this way for the rest of the, the the playthrough. And I'm not sure if every single zombie variant does do that. Oh yeah, money. I forgot that's a thing. 
in the game. Oh. Oh yeah, this uh, also this guy. Okay, hang on. So this guy, I'm just gonna give a little bit of exposition. Or wait, what was I saying? Nuts. Okay, I'm keeping them with the, the, the mustache and the sunglasses the rest of the day. Anyway, so this guy over here, he is the newspaper zombie. He has a little shield, and when it tears, as you can see, he he starts speeding up, so he gets a lot faster. Luckily, he's not super strong, but yeah. Also, these guys, I'm keeping them this way because I love it, and these I would keep this way as well. So yeah, this again, very chill first level. Just me hanging out with some shrooms. You know, that's always a good time. You know, just hanging out. Hey, you love just sitting down and like getting hitting some shrooms with your your stashed bros with the sunglasses and such. Your your your, your broskies, you know. That sounds like a good time to me, you know. So man, I love the music in this game. It's so good. But yeah. So, we got some pretty cool shrooms in this game. Uh, man, these guys are- Oh look, there he is! There's the boy! I forgot what I named him, but there he is! And now he's gone. Uh, oh. Heck yeah, do you hear that music? Oh, it's gone now. But that was a good song. Yay! And we're done. Heck yeah. Alright. Sun Shroom gives small sun at first and normal sun later. Sweet. Hey, you've collected 320 coins thus far. Okay. Can you collect 750? I'll say something neato. Hmm. Alright. Ah, bucket heads. Nuts. I was happy when those guys weren't around. Okay. We're just going with the basic layout because I don't really need too much. I'm, I should have brought the uh, cherry bomb instead of that dude. Okay, well, whatever. Uh, excuse me. What I got was unnecessary. <laughs> 15. How much do these give me? That seems at odds to the previous amount, like 25 and whatnot, that it used to give. That is bizarre. The new measurements. Anyway, uh, back to back to doing whatever. You know, now that I think about it, if I'm not mistaken, there's a uh, achievement for playing a night level with no mushrooms. So I'll probably do that on the next level because I don't want to have to deal with that on a hard level. So, and I would have done it on this one, but I forgot about it. So, oopsies. Whatever. It's okay. Start implementing the pea shooters now, and back to hanging out. Oh, interesting. So that's what it meant. They get bigger sun because they grow. Hey, man, I'm a grower too. I understand how it feels. People make fun of you because you give little sun, and you're like, hey, man, just watch. You just wait. I'll show you. And man, you showed me. I was literally just about to say, probably gonna replace these little ones with the sunflowers. But man, you're just not showing it yet, you know? Because those sunflowers, they got all they have up there, right? They don't improve at all. And that just shows you're going from an unexpectedness. You're Look at the big boys. You guys are becoming big boys. And I'm proud of you. You're taking what you've got and you're strutting your stuff. That's it. No insecurity. Also, I like how the sun ended up being rounded back to like the, the, seven, the 25. Because if it hadn't, I would have been really annoyed. Because then it would have just been like 30 or 15 or whatever. There would always be a remainder or something. So, anyway, back to me playing this game. Very slow moving at the beginning. So, but I, I've learned to play through it because it is very fun. I've had to play through it like four times for this. But it is fine. Because things will get interesting, especially the mini games. Things get real fun. So. Right now we gotta push through these more basic levels for the reward that is the future episodes. 
Because apparently none of this is hard enough for me to lose to. I hope. Oh boy. Oh, there he is! There he is! My boy! Also, if I'm not mistaken, my favorite music is also in this section. Or one of my two favorite songs. Hang on. Wait. And it fades too fast. It's such a good soundtrack. It's too good for this game. I mean, not really. I love this game as well. And, oh man, I just offended myself. Okay, this game is great, and the soundtrack it has is fantastic. And that is one of my favorite songs from a game. It's just so good. Stop thinking. No, don't do that. Stop. Money. All right. Anyway, there he is. Oh wait, hang on, hang on. Hold up. I'm gonna turn off the sound so we can enjoy the pure amazingness that is this music. Hmm. Here it comes. It's like the beat drop, but made of piano. Oh, it fades too fast. Okay, anyway. Woo! Yeah! All right. Okay. I do have something to say. Whew. Okay. <sighs> it's, I, it's, okay. <sighs> it's a little hard for me to... I know I need to, like, stay pumped, right? I need to keep my voice inflection-y. I need to stay talkative. Well, not necessarily talkative, but I need to say... It's, uh, uh, um, I need to stay excited? No, that's the wrong word. Whatever. I need to stay excited. I need to stay pumped up for this, right? Because I'm a YouTuber. And obviously, uh, it's not just that I'm a YouTuber, but it's just like, I want to sound excited because I love this game and I love doing this. However, I get, um, a little bit ah, zoned out, and I start just murmuring, and I don't like that. I've seen my own videos, I watch them, and so it's like, ah, I need to pay attention a little bit. But yeah, so I gotta stay a little bit pumped, you know? Okay, here we go. All right. Oh boy. Okay, so here's how we're gonna do... Oh no, okay. Ah, no, but I forgot him. Okay, so the way that... I don't want to explain it. I gotta show it. I'll show it in a different level. Because he, he, he's in every level past this, I believe. So we're going with... No mushrooms. Because this is the last opportunity I've got to do that sort of thing. Without it becoming really hard. Now... I wait. This one's gonna be a lot of patience for Sun. Because there's nothing I can really do. That's why I've got this bad boy. The potato mine, he's the saving grace of this particular uh, level. Because he's the only one that's gonna be saving me. <sighs> Hi, buddy. Love the sunglasses, man. You got some sick shades. Because the whole problem with this is that I need to be able to plant multiple sunflowers. So I need as much time as possible to do that. Oh, nuts! Dang it, now there's two of you! There's two of them down the same lane! Ah! Darn it! They're giving me the double dickens! Okay, luckily, I can resolve this with our good friend, the Potato Man. All I need is one son from this bad boy. And, oh uh, yeah! That sounded weird. <laughs> yeah, that's better. Um, bam. Now I'm protected. Good. Remember, kids, always use protection. Okay, I'm slowly concerned about this guy who's inching his way towards. Okay, here's how I'm gonna do. Oh no! Oh, there's so many ideas. Ah. Okay. Oh, nuts! Oh, frick. 
I have royally screwed up. Hmm. Okay. Whatever. If I if I give up now, then I'm still I'm just as screwed, if not more. Oh crap. Oh no. Ugh. It's a good thing there's only one wave, or I would be so messed up. Okay. Okay. I have to put down another sunflower. I just need to get two sun fast enough to put down a walnut, like we're in front of this dude. Okay. Uh, you know what? No. If I put that there, hopefully this will be good enough. Okay. I'm. I just. Oh, come on. All I need is this guy to raise. Come on, buddy. I know you have it in you. Raise. Raise. I know a lot of people tell their buddies to raise, but I know you. Yeah! You had it in you. All you needed to do was raise and to explode. And you performed just the way you were designed. I appreciate it. The reason I put it right there is because the minute it raises, that guy is dead. Ha! <laughs> ah, okay. I really need to start focusing my resources onto key shooters, but I can't do that. Oh, there he goes. I can't do that yet. I have to focus. Ugh. I have to focus on protection because I don't have any. Okay. Okay, I gotta not. Okay, I have to do pea shooter. So no more sunflowers yet. Because I need a pea shooter. Oh, frick. Come on, come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Kill him. Kill him. Please, please, please. I have hardly any time. Oh, no. Oh, no. He's not gonna die. Anything if he does, this guy's not. Please, 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 please. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. No, one more. One more. Ah, but, oh, I'm, ah. Here's what we're gonna do. This is important. This is important. This is important. This is important. Okay, whatever. We're just gonna go with this. We're gonna do a different strap. Similar, but different. Okay, already I'm doing better, first of all. Secondly, I have a strategy devised in mind. Oh, crap. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, well, I'm already doing worse now. Okay, I thought that would make it. Anyway, if I have a strategy, other than this guy eating my sunflower, which is sacrificing the lawnmowers in order to survive the beginning. Because once I get past the point where I no longer need to put down sunflowers, I should be in the clear. Okay. Waste of sun, but it has to be done. That guy is dangerous. And the rest can be taken on by a lot less. Okay, what do I want? Oh. Pop that right there. And put down our first actual bit of defense there. Okay, now we've gotten started. Now we can actually do things. Oh, that was a close one. I thought we were going to make it. Okay, here we go. It's the beginning of something great. Frick. Frick, he missed the walnut? How could you have missed the walnut? Oh, god darn it. That really sucks for me. Okay, that's fine. At least I'm going to have a pea shooter on every lane. That's really all that matters. However, that is very concerning because that means... Oh no, this guy's not... This guy's going to miss the walnut too and kill me. Ha! That! I mean, not actually. Okay, I've only got... So I don't have to worry about these two lanes at all. Top two lanes. I gotta be concerned about. Okay, this lane don't have to be worried about at all. Just gotta. Okay. Oh, this lane I've gotta be concerned about though. Ooh, that's not great. That's not good. Ooh, the music. The music cheers me up. Ah, uh, see ya, bud. I will win. It's not 
gonna be the prettiest of wins. It's gonna be an unfortunate. It's gonna be like a gruesome win, right? I win by the skin of my teeth. With all my lawnmowers and things to watch. And yeah. But at least I'm gonna win. At least as long as this holds up. Ooh, that's not that's not looking too great for me, but okay. I think I'll be fine. Two should be enough to take him down. And I don't I hope it is, because I don't have anything. Else. Oh uh, yeah, baby! Okay. That's all I had left going for me. Yeah! Dirties! No fungus among us! Earned! Complete a night level without using any mushrooms. I'm so great at using mushrooms, or not using mushrooms, according to what I want. Also, that just reminded me. I have a joke for you guys. I have a mushroom joke for you guys. Why did the zombies want to hang out with the mushroom? Because he was a fun guy! <laughs> anyway, grave eater. Plant it on a grave to remove the grave. That's super useful, because you can't plant on graves. What's up? Uh, no. I'm saving my money for better things, because I remember this shop comes in at some point, and you can buy some real good stuff. Okay, now I can actually properly display the fume shroom to you guys. Um, well, okay, so now I can display the fume shroom. And the grave eater. Okay, first up. Aha, here is the grave eater. I want to take down this one, because uh, with her waves, the graves summon guys. So here's how it works. You just plant it on it. And he chows down, and he gives me money! So that's actually a great way to farm for money, is just go into a night level and just plop him down on a grave, and voila! Here's what the fume shroom does. He shoots a ranged, kind of like flamethrower -y attack. And the thing about his attack is that it goes through um, barrier zombies. So like the newspaper zombie and like the screen door zombie and such. Um, it renders those useless. Completely worthless. I'm not doing too bad. This is going far better than that previous one where I neglected to do use mushrooms. It just goes to show that using mushrooms makes life easier. Always do mushrooms, kids. Ah, here we go. The next wave. With our beautiful boy. If anybody in the comments, if anyone watches this and decides to comment anything, comment a name for this guy. I mean, you don't have to. I might name him the next episode. But like, come on up. For the seven people that end up watching it, why don't you just comment something, you know? This is like a little bit of contribution. Use it, baby. Yeah. Man, I love being able to set up mutant defensive plants in my yard and have it kill creatures walking slowly towards my house and then be paid for it. It's genius. It's like I'm the military. Here we go. Final wave. Haha. <laughs> Alright, here we go. With our boy up in the corner leading the charge and an army. Oh, spectacled, pistached zombies charging in. You will not get far. You may defeat one or two of the puff rooms, but they are cannon fodder compared to the soldiers we have out back. The almanac, of course, the staple of any good game. Almanac, suburban almanac. Alma Mac, the suburban Alma Mac, keeps track of all plants and zombies you encounter. First, let's view plants. The pea shooter, first line of defense, they shoot peas at attacking zombies, damage normal. How can a single plant grow and shoot so many peas so quickly? Pea shooter says, hard work, commitment, and a healthy, well-balanced breakfast of sunlight and high, f high fiber carbon dioxide make it all possible. Yes, indeed, sunlight and high, fi high fiber carbon dioxide sure make you pee better. Sunflowers are essential for you to reproduce extra sun. Eh, not reproduce, let me be clear. 
to produce extra sun. Try planting as many as you can. Sun production normal. Camera's it's bouncing to the beat. That's cool. Alright. Cherry bomb. Blow up all zombies. I want to explode. Oh, let's detonate. After an intense consultation, they agree to explodinate. Genius! Everyone loves a good compromise. That's the saying, right? They are walnuts. People wonder how I feel about getting constantly chewed. They don't realize is that with my limited senses, all I can feel is a kind of tickling. Like a relaxing back rub. True, but I feel like that would creep me out knowing that that tickling is me slowly being eaten away. Uh, anyway. I'm not gonna look at too many of these. I'll, like, flick through them, you know? So they're pretty cool. But... Yeah. So, anyway. Also, this is kind of interesting, where it says damage massive compared... Because that means... Uh, that means that he doesn't just eat one zombie. Oh, horse. That is so great. I love that. The little shop of horrors reference. I never noticed that before. Was that always in this game? Alright, whatever. Anyway. Okay. Ever play a game called Whack a Zombie? Just like hunting squirbos. Yeah, you know, those furry little rodents that dig holes in your lawn. Except instead of squirbos, it's zombies. And instead of a shovel, it's a mallet. Hmm. I like sounds game. It's a me, it's you! Get her whacking! This is exact. This is what I'm saying about mini games, because like in the future when we unlock the mini games, this is what we get, and it's great. All right, I must put this on pause. Okay. 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 Hang on. I will be back. I must do something in the real world, and I know I could edit this out, but I'm not going to just because. So I, I'll be right back. Hang on. All right, guys, I am back. And wait until you hear why I left. So, I got a new mic. And I have no idea if it's better than the old one. Actually, I do, a little bit. I tested it. And it has more range, and I'm not quite sure about the quality. So we're gonna find out. And let's get to whacking. So this is like, um, kind of one of the more generic games. Cause it's just a, you know, it's a play on whack -a -mole. However, it is fun. And it makes a lot of money. Because there's a lot of grave users going around nabbing me coins. Which is kind of weird to think. What generates the coins in this world, you know? Look at that. Where did that come from? This dude's pockets? My pickpocketing corpses. But yeah, I do like how they kind of implement these mini games into the main story universe. Unfortunately, I'm not getting any sun. Oh, there we go. Uh-oh. Nuts. I could have had three of these down by now. Okay. Oh, cone heads. Oh, yeah, I forgot about them. What happens if you take this, take an auto clicker to this? Okay, come on. And uh, the mini game version of this is a lot harder. So if it seems easy, These guys are fast. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, okay, that one can wait because did it.
That was easy as pie. Hypno Shroom makes a zombie fight for you. Now, back in the day, when I was a kid, my granddaddy told me. He was like, son, mushrooms are delicious. They're good for your diet. And back when I played this game, I didn't know that this is a play on the fact that shrooms are like drugs. I do now. Let's drug some zombies. Um. Mm, let's go to the walnut. Okay. Alright, same old. Alright, so this is what I got this far, and now we're just encountering this a bad boy. And I'm not quite sure what I want to do, because I don't have anything. If I had a Hypno Shroom, I'd get him. Oh, wait. Who's that? Oh! That dude just got whacked out. He's tripping so hard, he's gonna eat zombies. Alright, here we go. Final wave. I haven't used the Hypno Shroom very much, and I just... This has been a very normal level. So, there's our boy. Alright. So what I might want to do is hypnotize the football player so we can really see what it does. So, hang on. Give me, like, I don't know. Battle music, baby. Give me a sign. Here we go. Come on. Uh, yeah! Watch this. He's going to eat him. Oh, and he ate him. Kind of anticlimactic, but you know. All's fair in love and weed. Or... All's fair in love and shroom. Maybe it's one last coin I can... Wait. Can I squeeze out this last coin? <gasps> oh, so worth it. Heck yeah. Look at this guy. He looks like a smurf. Long range shooter that hides when enemies get near it. Scaredy shroom. Ha. <laughs> That's good. It's good to have some range because the... the Fume shrooms don't have a ton of range. Okay, so we're gonna give all of the generic ones a shot. Okay, so as a new, like, kind of starter strat, I'm going to, once I've put down all the uh, sun shrooms, I'm gonna try out something else. So, yeah. Okay, so here, here's, I've got all of them out. So here's the scaredy shroom. Look at that boy, he's a tall boy. You know, he's tall and skinny. So not necessarily the best quality, but hey, he's got some, so. However, here, here's what it means by like, gets afraid, right, when zombies approach. So when zombies get like within a block, he hides. He's a shy guy, you know, he doesn't want, he, he's got, he's got the length, but he's just insecure. So he just has to hide sometimes, you know, which is understandable. Sometimes everybody needs a time to just kind of sit back and like, maybe just retreat for a little bit, you know? Look within oneself and think about whether what they have is really enough. I get terrible advice, I'm very sorry. Not, I'm not sorry at all. Alright, final wave. My layout is fairly good. I got two layers of the scary shrooms in the back. Then a bunch of fume shrooms and then puff shrooms is a meat shield in the front. So I'm too good at this. I am a pro when it comes to planters of zombies. I am a strategic genius. You can't beat my plants. These, I, you can't beat my seed. It's too good. Oh man, that guy's going far though. You fool! You've been tricked! Got him. Haha. -ha. That's the sound of victory. Look at all that money. Oh, look at that! I don't even know what that achievement's for, but something about money. Alright, Ice Room temporarily immobilizes everything on the screen. 
Ah! Dancing zombie. What up, bro? Oh, yeah. I forgot that there are zombies here as well. <laughs> God, I screened it for after. If you ate the homeowner's brains! Alright. Alright, so we're just going with the standard layout. So, because I don't need the ice room. I'm too good for that. Let's rock! Alright. So. Uh, see you guys. In a bit. Ah! What's up, bro? Nuts! Okay, here we go. Hang on. All I need now is just to uh, wait and watch this. Watch this, guys. Yeah! Because watch this. He should be able to, as long as he doesn't get... Don't die. Don't die. Please. Yes! He raises up disco minions! I love it! Heck yeah! Look at that guy! There he goes! Oh, he can't defeat the conehead, but he can always just raise more. I love that. Okay, got a disco zombie. Alright, so immediately, okay, got the disco zombie. So that means they're no longer a problem. And in fact, they're a help. Alright, now I just gotta mow my way through these guys. Which actually, you know what, seeing the, the disco zombies reminds me that there's like a special way that these guys can die sometimes. Like that's, these are just the normal ways of dying, right? And then, but sometimes they can do like a dance death, which I love that. I love the dance death, but I haven't seen it yet. So keep an eye out for that. Doom shroom. Ugh. Excuse me. So good at this game. Doom Shroom destroys a large area, leaving a crater in its wake. I love the Doom Shroom. Okay. Alright, I might switch out the Hypno Shroom for the Doom Shroom, both to show you what it does during like a wave or something, and because uh, the Hypno Shroom's not that useful. While it does take out the Dancing Zombie in one, the Doom Shroom does that as well. And does everybody so and it's just more fun to use so okay see you guys in a bit <sighs> okay I hope I can get three more Sun for uh, everything dies because I have a, a very strong setup so it's like um, I want to use the doom shroom okay come on one more yeah oh boy uh, you know what here let me blow it up right there give a good look It has a much larger radius, but it, it leaves a crater that you can't plant on. So, you know, every good thing comes with a downside. And in this case, atomic it, atomic plants come with the downside of leaving nuclear waste behind, I guess. Oh. Heck yeah. Hello, we would like to visit for midnight, Zach. How does ice cream and brain sound? Sincerely, the zombies. All right. This is the end of night, or the night world. That's a lot of graves. Oh boy. All right, here we go. Okay, well, it gave me a Doom Shroom right off the bat, which is not what I want. Grave Buster, I'll take. Ah! See, that's a temporary, and I never used that to show you guys. Dang it! Give me some that. Gosh! Oh yeah, that's what the freeze room does. Forgot to, I need to narrate. So, okay, right now I'm just trying to create layers. And so, we got scaredy shroom at the back, where he's least likely to be attacked. We got fume shroom in the middle, protected by a nice little flesh wall of this dude here. And these guys, 
or all the temporary ones that I'm saving for emergencies or just like whenever. Oh, excuse me. Now every lane technically has protection, but every lane does not have like ranged protection or like a meat wall or whatever. I'll freeze everything for a bit just to give. Oh good, thank goodness I did. Cause you see that bad boy right there? That is our good friend the disco zombie. Oh, and he's too late. He summons some of these bugs. Alright, I'll use one of these bad boys. Bye! Love the Doom Shrooms, guys. Alright. And now I'm just gonna start layering. So, um, yeah. Woo! I like these. They are a little slow moving, but they're fun. Here we go. Look at that. It's just a wall of plants. There's a few zombies that are gonna be frozen and then blown up. Freeze! Bye! Freeze! The remainder of you! That's the most anticlimactic end battle I've ever seen. Hang on, don't worry, it gets worse. Watch this! Okay, maybe I should wait for their waves to actually come in, because right now they don't really have anything. Okay, last one! Look at those craters. <laughs> All right. Okay. Woo. World two over, and now I've got the lily pad. Let's you plant non-aquatic plants on top of it. That here's the next world. What up, Dave? Looks like zombies gave up attacking your front yard. Good. Now they're trying your backyard. Not as good. And to top it all off, you can't even use your mushrooms. Because they fall asleep during the day. That gets remedied. There's a plant that fixes that, but it's expensive. Well, isn't that just dandy? Alright. Alright, guys. Well, as fun as that is, that's gonna have to be it for this episode. I know it's been a while, I'm trying to upload quicker, and I got things going on in the world. So I would have uploaded this sooner, but I didn't have time. Now I did, and so I did it. It's done. Voila! Video. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more, make sure to subscribe. That's the first time I've said that, but I mean it in such a way that if you enjoy my content, subscribe, because I come out with it. It is mostly consistent this one has taken a lot of my time because there were some issues but other than that it's fine it's all fine guys it's gonna get better as time goes on i know i haven't unlocked that or that so guys i'll see you next time bye